Well, hello everybody, I'm back. This is Rose, and I am continuing with the second diamond painting in the Cuff W Key order of three diamond paintings that I started unboxing in my last, um, well, not necessarily the last video that I posted, but I'm now, I'm, I've opened the first of the diamond paintings, that was the wolf in the garden, and now I am opening the second diamond painting, which is a Japanese kimono, is what I call this one. I loved the Japanese princess, well I'm loving the Japanese princess that I got from Cuff W. Key so much that um, when I saw this Japanese kimono with different colors, but um, a very similar um, subject, I thought, yeah, I'm going to get that. So here it is. And this one is 80 by 60. Hold on. It's uh, 80 by 60 centimeters, so before we do anything else, I'm going to measure the diamond painting. Yeah. Yeah, it's exact again. Well, it's just a smidge. No, it's not. It's exactly 80 centimeters high or wide by exactly 60 centimeters wide. So that's, uh, that's correct. Now let me pull back. All right, I wanna get as much in the frame as possible. So the paper's got two strips to it. way is up here. So, I'm just, I don't want to tear the paper, which is why I'm trying to be as careful as I possibly can. take you out of the holder. All right, and so here is the diamond painting that I call Japanese kimono. And it's these beautiful pinks and reds. I think it's just exquisite. And I think we're going to get really good definition on her hair, her face the kimono, the roses around her. Yeah, I think it's going to be beautiful. Just beautiful. Yeah. Oh, I'm happy with this. That's going to be a lot of work, but it's going to be a joy to do if it's anything like the Japanese princess that I'm working on right now. Okay, I'm afraid my cats are going to come and try and check things out and I don't want any of them walking across the painting so I'm going to pause again and uh, I'll uh, get back to um, covering her up. Alright, now I know there's a lot of glare, it's because it, the sun is just going down and so this is not the best time of day to be shooting a video but I wanted to, I was just desperate to open these. And there is quite a bit of hair on there. I gave the floor a sweep just before. 
before I put the paintings down, but oh well, there will be a little tiny bit of cat fur on the canvas. But that canvas, they don't come any better than this. Oh, uh, now I did not show you the drill field. So I'll, I'll pull back the, um, the top and I'll show you the drill field when I do that. Cats, you gotta love them. But they do mess up your diamond paintings if you're not careful. I am trying to be very, very careful. Okay, so let me just pull back the top bit here that we didn't see yet. And I know I'm pulling back more than necessary. But I do want to show you her face. When, uh, when I show you the drill field. So here we are out of the cradle. I'm gonna zoom in so that you can see her face and the drill field. It's as crystal clear as can be. There is nothing ambiguous about these symbols. I love the way Cuff W Key does their symbols. Just beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Yeah. All symbols that are either letters, alphanumeric ca characters, or um, keyboard symbols that you'd be able to find on a typewriter if you were still using a typewriter. Okay, I want to find a legend. So I'm just going to close this up. Uh, you're not going to see me close it up because I'm just going to pause the recorder for a minute. Okay. So uh, again, here is the, uh, there's the thumbnail. Not sure if, it's not showing too well. Anyway, uh, you'll have seen the thumbnail on the, the um, on the thumbnail for this video and let's just take a quick look at the colors and the symbols and again there is nothing here that I think will be no nothing here is going to cause me any any trouble now one thing that Cuff W Key does is they use both parentheses both the open and the closed parentheses and uh, because there's so many pinks in this, uh, it turns out that they're both pinks, but one's a very light pink and one's a darker pink. So I don't think that's going to be a problem. Yeah, I don't think that's going to be a problem. It's just something to keep in mind while I'm drilling, because I do drill upside down. Um, like I'll drill, okay, when I'm doing this diamond painting, I will do the top 12 inches and then I will flip the thing around and then I'll work down from there. And um, yeah, and so that's how I'm gonna do this diamond painting. All right, uh, let me put you back in the holder and I'll give you the price and all of that stuff. Uh, let's see, 80 by 60 square drills. Um, from the Cuff W Key store, uh, the Cuff W Key official store on AliExpress. This one cost me, well, the regular price was $56.09, but in total I got an 18% discount uh, from AliExpress on this. Uh, and that was a couple of different discounts that I just added together and then figured out what is the percentage of total discount to the total price of this three painting order and it worked out to 18 percent so the price after discounts were applied was 46 dollars canadian for this 
So about $30 American, I think, maybe a little less than $30 American, which I think is a really, really good price. Um, I ordered it on uh, March 30th. They shipped it a day or two later. And I, I don't have the shipping uh, date right now, but I think it was like, I was amazed at how quickly they shipped it. And um, today is April 16th as I open this and it arrived a few hours ago. So I'm very, very happy with the shipping and everything. And I didn't show you the back of the wolf in the garden, but okay, these bubbles that you see here, that's because I didn't lay the, the paper back down perfectly flat, but there is absolutely nothing wrong with these canvases. They are perfect. So as I mentioned in my previous video, so far Cuff W Key and Ali, uh, not AliExpress, Cuff W Key and Evermoment to me are equal in quality. Uh, Cuff W Key is cheaper for the same, uh, for the same products. And so now, I am, okay, so as, as I said yesterday, I got this order in two shipments. And what they did was they shipped all three canvases together and the diamonds are in a separate package uh, because the weight was too much for it to come all in one package. So um, I have been tracking the shipment for uh, the diamonds and uh, I'm expecting to receive them tomorrow. So the next time you see me, it'll be like five, not even five seconds for you, but it'll be, you know, a couple of seconds from when I stop this recording, but it'll be the next day or whatever day I get the diamonds. And I will attach that as part two of this diamond, of this uh, diamond painting unboxing it'll all be strung together in a single video. But I'll have three separate videos for the three separate canvases that I ordered. Okay? So uh, I will see you again. Momentito. Well, hello, everybody. It's Rose. And I am back with part two of chapter two of the incredible Cuff W Key order. And so today what I am opening is the drills that arrived for the Japanese kimono. So that is the thumbnail there. Um, you just saw the opening of the canvas, so I don't need to remind you about all the other stuff. Woo hoo 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 hoo! Woo hoo 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 hoo! Look at those colors. Oh my God. Oh my God. Those colors are amazing. And you're going to see them all because I am going to be doing the inventory of the drills on camera in full. No fast forwarding. Those of you who don't like watching opening or inventories, uh, without fast forwarding, feel free to put it on double time. I'll sound like a chipmunk, but that's okay. You can turn off the volume or whatever. Um, yeah. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Look at those drills. They are just beautiful. Now, before I get into the drills, once again, uh, all of the um, all of the drills were shipped in the same package, and I got six sets of tweezers, boats with cutout, and uh, single placer um, pens. So I am very happy to get extra drill boats because I now have a use for them. Um, okay, so let us begin this inventory. 
First off, I will show you the inventory sheet because I'm not sure how well you saw the uh, legend, but uh, this tells you a lot more information. And again, I really like the symbols. I'll probably have to be careful because as you see here, we've got the greater than sign and we've got the less than sign and they're sort of, hold on, I want you to be both to be in focus on the screen. We'll just turn that that way. They're kind of the same color, sort of. They're in the same color range, which means that when I'm working on the painting upside down, I'm going to have to be paying really, really close attention to, um, oh my goodness, look at that. Oh my goodness. Okay, that is just gorgeous. This inventory. 3382, 1, 2, 3, 4. Oh no, 3322. No, 3822. Jeez, 4. What is going on? How come I couldn't say that? Alright. Uh 3760. Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. And I'm just going to make sure that you can see what I'm doing. Yeah, you can. Okay, good. Good. 3804. Oh, wait a minute. That was 3760. Did I mark it? No. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, and ten thirty-eight oh fours. Thirty-eight fifteen, I have three. Thirty-three fifty-four, seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now, there is a predominance of pinks and purples in this diamond painting, which is to be expected given the pinks and purples dominating the, uh, the picture. Okay, 945, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Okay. Uh, 38. Hmm. I'm not sure what number that is. 3819, I guess. I need three bags, so that's 3819. The uh, number is partially, like it didn't stamp properly. So it's tough to read what that is. 38, 19 is three. And just to make sure that uh, the indelible ink doesn't get rubbed off from these things rubbing against each other in the storage bag. I'm just going to put some tape over it. That'll protect. That'll protect the uh, the magic marker. Okay, thirty-eight, thirty-five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, and nineteen. And that's what I need. Yeah. 
See a few little stowaways in there, but that's okay. That's okay. 30, 38, 35. Did I mark that off? Yes. One, two, three, four, five, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, and 18. Thirty-eight, fifty-three, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 3808, I have two. 3838, one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh my god, these colors are just so gorgeous. Look at this. Two. I need nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Five fifty. One, two, three, four. Five sixty four. Three. What a stunning color. <gasps> Ooh, can you see that? I hope you can see that because that is just, uh, that is just out, out of this world. Uh, there's a lot of it and I'm so glad. Uh, 304, I need 5,924 of them. I've got 30 bags probably. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, and 30. So that is the predominant color in this diamond painting. And I am A-OK -okay with that. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Three, ten, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. These feel fuller than some of the others. Ooh, look at that. Seven eighteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine of them. Thirty-seven twenty-one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one. Thirty-seven twenty-one. No. Hold on. I gotta do this the other way. Ooh, 
Oh, my goodness, look at that. I just have to sit here and love this color for a moment. Bear with me. Oh, my goodness. This is 3705. I don't remember ever having received this before. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, and fourteen. Oh my goodness! Whoa. Okay, my pencil just broke. Thirty-seven, oh five. Good. That's because I was so excited. I pressed too hard. Okay. I've still got so many beautiful colors to go. All right. 919, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. Uh, 919, 23, okay. All right. 902, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 902s. How am I going to decide which of my diamond paintings to do next? Now, I, I think I want to do, when I finish the uh, stained glass flower, I want to do... A, um, I want to do a crystal, uh, like the special shapes ones, because I've never done one yet, and I've ordered so many. Um, so that was 902, I think I marked it off. Yeah, I did. Okay. Um, one, two, three, four, five. And I'm still doing the Cuff WP uh, Japanese Princess, but I took... Like I was doing it, like one section of Japanese princess and one section of stained glass flower. But then I was just getting so frustrated with the stained glass flower that what I found myself doing was avoiding working on the Japanese princess because I knew that the next day I'd have to work on the stained glass flower. So now I'm incentivizing myself to finish the stained glass flower by not doing the Japanese princess, which I am dying to do again, until I've finished the stained glass flower. So I have maybe a day and a half of stained glass flower, and then I'm going to be back to Japanese princess. But I think what I'm going to do is work on a crystal, like a special shapes one at the same time. And when I finish the special shapes one, I think I'm finally going to do the peacock and peonies that, uh, that I got early on. It was a, a large one, not the French peacock that I got recently from Royal Diamond Painting, but uh, the peacock and peonies that had like this swath of white across the top um, that's round drills. And uh, because I just, I need to do some round drills. I think from now on, I'm going to balance off my square drills with doing a round drill or a special shapes or a crystal uh, rhinestone diamond painting um, like at the same time so that I'm not like overwhelmed with trying to place squares all the time. Uh, okay, so 824, I got four. It wouldn't be a Rambling Rose uh, video if there weren't digressions. 844, one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, I need 1199 of the 844s. They sent me six bags. So that, again, that just tells me there are more than 200 diamonds in each bag because there's no way that they would send one extra diamond. Like, that would just be ridiculous. Okay, and Cup WP is not ridiculous. Okay, uh, 891. Okay, I just have to, once more... Just look at the 
that. Okay, so unfortunately, my camera kit cut out before I finished the inventory. Some of you might be saying, yay, I was bored out of my skull. And others are saying, boo, I missed out on a whole bunch of beautiful colors. Um, and so what I say is to those who said, boo, I missed out on a bunch of beautiful colors. Yes, you did miss out on a bunch of beautiful colors um, because this is exquisite just absolutely gorgeous i'm going to turn on the flash for a moment just so that you get um the most of the colors now you don't so to those of you who said boo i say yes you are correct there is a big boo because look at what you missed just look at what you missed these colors are unbelievable. And I got everything that I was supposed to get. Uh, the inventory was perfect. So I now have my kit labeled to um, put away in my storage. And there's Canada Post at the door. Just a moment. Look what I got. It's another diamond. Oh, let's see. Okay, there's only one here, but I know that there are three diamond paintings. Uh, no, there's only one picture here, but there are three diamond paintings. These are diamond paintings that I ordered from um, Alibaba uh, just about a week ago. So they sent them by courier. I guess that's why I paid $28 shipping. Um... But it was my first major order from Alibaba. I wanted to try them out. And just to give you a teaser, there are three short lint canvas diamond paintings that I ordered. And uh, yeah, so I'll be doing the openings on those. Um, I don't know if I'm going to do them later this afternoon. Maybe not later this afternoon, because uh, I got dinner with a bunch of women who I used to work with. And so I got to get, start getting myself ready and I got to go pick up cat food. Um, okay, anyway, so here is the Japanese princess. She's all done. I had everything, uh, not the Japanese princess, the Japanese kimono, 80 by 60, square drills, all drills, present and accounted for. Um, and I am going to look forward to doing this one. There are so many in the queue that I want to do. I don't know when exactly I'm going to do it, but she's going to get done for sure. So uh, that's it. That is the end of part two, the drills of chapter two, Japanese kimono of the incredible Cuff W key order. On to part two of chapter three. Um, but before that, if you have not yet given this video a like, please do, right? I, I, please do. Give it a thumbs up. Um, and I want to thank all of my subscribers for sticking with me through thick and thin and detailed inventory taking. Um, I really appreciate your attention. I love the fact that you come back to me and give me comments. I love your comments so, 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 so much. So please do continue to uh, give me comments because they mean the world to me. And, uh, and I do respond to everyone in some way. So uh, yeah, thanks so much. And I will be back with chapter three shortly. Bye-bye.